Like most people, I didn't even think about caregiving until my father was diagnosed with cancer. My dad was somebody who I idolized. I used to dress up like him when I was a kid in kindergarten and get made fun of because I wanted to wear like a suit and a tie. And then to go from that to giving him a bath is, is, a, is a quite a um, traumatic thing. Everyone has a care story. Caring for our families is the most important and invisible work that we will ever do. Do you think we look alike? There you go. Doesn't matter who you are, where you live, what you do, where you come from, you need care. How you feeling this morning? You good? And we have this invisible army who are essentially holding us all up as families and therefore holding the entire economy up. Let me cut dry your face. People are doing everything they can and more, and it's simply not sufficient because we need to have a recognition that care is a public good. So my dad is actually a medically retired Navy SEAL. And now he's like helping me just get stronger. Well, I'm here caring for two sick people, which is definitely hard, harder than anything I've ever done in my life. There's just this simmering crisis. Everyone is burning out, whether it's the care worker or the family member. Everyone is under extreme duress. I have reintroduced a credit for caring bill. It is for those that are caring for their loved ones. We're trapped in a caregiving crisis, within an economic crisis, within a health care crisis. I want to change the paradigm. Now we have a once in a generation opportunity to support all of our families and our caregivers too. It really is up to us. All of us can help raise the banner for caregivers. That's why I'm excited to partner with WIDA and produce this documentary. Together, with your help, we can make a difference.